This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Principles, Unit 5, Building Apps, Lesson 1, Buttons and Events, Puzzle 19. Using set position and random number. Now you try it. Instead of using fixed values, use random number to set the X and Y coordinates for a set position. Now you have to chase the button all over the screen. Make, make it so that the button can jump anywhere on the visible screen each time it's clicked. Extend it. If you want to get really nuts you can add back you can add back in width and height parameters of set position ah so you can also change the size randomly okay got it boom so let's go to math here and grab random and we're going to drop one here for our x one here for our y okay i'm going to shrink that for a sec and then for x now remember, buttons are drawn from their top left corner, right? Rectangles are. So I'm going to say like 2, 2 as a buffer. And then how large is this? 140. So 320 minus 140 or 150 if you want to be safe. Let's say 170 for X. So we'll say... 10 to 170 because I want X to be visible and since it's getting drawn from its top left corner I want it to have enough room to show the whole button and then this is going to be um, I guess we'll say 10 still and then it goes all the way to 450 I'm not sure what how wide is our button looks like our buttons like 40 ish 30 ish actually but and it goes from the top so we'll say 400 let's see what that looks like now remember when i click run we now have this on event function and it is quote unquote listening anytime something with the id move it button and that's what this id is has an id of is clicked it executes this function it's going to pick a random number for x and y between x is 10 and 170 y is 10 and 400. <laughs> Ooh, it's staying down here. That's fun. Let's do the, what they suggest, and I just have to try, is um, messing with the, oh, that makes it difficult. I'm going to switch to text mode real quick. Shrink that down, because I want to use random numbers here, too. And I couldn't otherwise. I'm just going to right-click, copy, paste. Paste these. We don't want it to be um, a size of or a height of and a width of 400. So for the width, I'm gonna say I I don't know. Let's mess with it. 40 to I think I said it is 140 right now. Let's try 200 and then height of. I thought it was 40 ish. So we'll say 20 to 60 maybe. Who knows? I might just break it. Let's go back to blocks. <laughs> That's really cool. Awesome. Let's uh, keep going. 